on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Uh, how did you? Oh, I'm strong. I mean, that is uh, one of my one of the potentials of my quirk. But I, I, he cured you. No, he tried. I am also highly durable. I, how? Well, my quirk, of course. Man, if I, this kid gets captured by all for one. It could be very dangerous. But what if I... No, 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 it's too soon. But then... <laughs> I'm sorry, all mine. But this fight is mine now. Wait, wait, what? Yes, he attempted my... To take my life away, as well as my mother's, and I cannot allow that to happen. But you can't fight here. You can't fight a villain here. Is it because of the rebel? Well, no. Is this private property? It, well, no. So this area is public. Correct. So can I fight here? Well, technically yes. Then. Thank you for your permission. And Izuku just leaps after Awful One, who is still gathering his thoughts, and he's like, did I really just get bitch slapped by a kid? Yes, yes he did. Which, as soon as he sees Izuku, he feels like, um... Well, for at least your quarter could be very useful, my what? Izuku getting captured and forced to the ground. As he's like, why is this giving me flashbacks of my previous parents? Over one trying to take his quirk. Too bad his abilities aren't a quirk. Upon realizing that nothing's working, Izuku breaks out of his restraints, grips off one by his neck, and starts Hulk slamming him. Then he uses a certain technique that all those who read it, or at least seen it in a certain anime, he's a dumbed down version of the technique, he uses it all for one as nunchucks. And the amount of blood that is spraying around the whole area is incredible. It is a huge ass mess to the point where Alpha One is unconscious. As soon as Alpha Myron sees this, he's like, okay. Kid? Yeah. Alright, I'm finished with this fight. He is beaten. Uh, listen, you're going to come with me to the station. Oh, you wish for me to help you, uh, uh, what would they say, throw the book at this criminal, which I don't really understand the point, he doesn't need a book thrown at him, are you serious, always, well, you're not supposed to use your quirk to, oh, is there something wrong with me using it? Well, yes, but as you can see, my quirk is always active. So, if anything, it's not like I'm using it because I want to. I have no other choice. Uh, wait, what are you trying to say? Well, since my quirk is always active, I can't turn it off. And by that logic, I'm always using my quirk. So... If either you are going to have to lock me away forever, or we come to a compromise. Are, are you serious? 
as I said before, always. Ego just running in there, holding Izuku, saying, please don't lock him up, and please, Izuku, don't do anything so reckless again. So, uh, what's wrong? Why are you crying, mother? Just call me Inko. But you are my mother. You're that comfortable with me? Of course, him hugging her back. Her about to start a flood with her tears. Suku just patting her on the back saying, It's okay, I'm I'm sorry for worrying you. Though I have a fair amount of control when it comes to my abilities. So go, me going out of control as an unsaid <sighs> Either way, please be more careful. Well, I made sure there were no civilians where I, I uh, struck him. That's, that's not something that kind of careful. I mean, you could have gotten hurt. Unlikely. Killed. Very unlikely. Uh, well, uh, young... Midoriya. Well, young Midoriya. <sighs> if anything, you have spirit. What? Well, what's a spirit? You see, we're just taking off, taking out his phones. I have a ghost. No, no, no. That's not. not that is not what I meant. It's like well, you just said I had spirit. <clears throat> Yeah, you have the spirit over here. I have a ghost. No, no, that, that it has nothing to do with ghosts. I mean, you. Mm. How should I explain this? He's saying you're going to be a good hero. Oh, why didn't you just say that? Hmm. <sighs> Either way, I would like to take you to a friend of mine. In which hmm, we can see what. What's next for you? What does that mean? Just trust me. Hmm. I was told not to trust strangers, but since you are the number one hero, I suppose I should at least give you the benefit of the doubt. But first, we should get rid of this villain. As Awful One shakenly just like, why couldn't I take her quirk? Before he just passes out again. And blood loss. Wait, what, what does he mean you're, he couldn't take a quirk? Mm, I don't know. He just restricted my movements and placed his hand over my forehead. This red lightning started to envelop me, but I didn't feel a thing. Uh... So you hmm. could he have a quirk like one for all somehow? Hmm. No, that might something else must be going on here. Hmm. Either way, yes, I'll take you to my friend after we send this jerk to Tartarus. All right. Upon booking all for one, all my he feels a huge weight just get lifted from his shoulders. He's just so happy. He's like after all this time, after all the loss, the pain, etc. He's finally behind bars. Hmm. So this friend of yours. Yes, what about me? Is this the boy? Yes, Izuku Midoriya. He seems to... Hmm. Have a special quirk of some kind. You don't say. Okay, let's let's take a look. Izuku just backing up was like... Last time... Someone put their hands on my face... It was a villain. I am not letting that happen again. 
Well, I trust Sir Night Eye. You do? Yes. And I know for a fact that you can trust him as well. Since all my seems to trust you and I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt, you may uh, do whatever, I suppose. Very well. As soon as Nice looks into the near future, he's pretty much like, What the hell? What? What, what did you see? I, uh, I, I don't know what I saw. Oh, Night Eye, what, what are you talking about? Come on, there's gotta be some. No, I mean, I, I have no idea what kind of nonsense that was. I mean, I see him fighting a lot. These weird creature things making, it's making no sense to me. What are you talking about, glasses? Uh, well, your future seems filled with a lot of fighting, people cheering, calling you something. Izuku, the Slayer, I, I it's, but this is years with it before, uh, or as after I, some of this stuff is weird as all hell. I, I, what did you see? I told you what I saw, and I don't understand any of it. There are these ships, these, this weird place. It looks lively. This huge arena. I, I, I don't understand it. I, I don't understand any of it. All I know is that this is a lot, a, a, a lot, a lot to really unpack here. I'm going to need to clear my thoughts. What are you, kid? I am Izuku Midoriya. I, I know. <sighs> well, how about this? How would you like training with me? Really? Yes. You helped me defeat... A very powerful villain. Hmm. Very well. But I have a request. Uh, okay. What? Can you also invite the other top heroes? What? Yes. I would like to test my skills up against them as well. Why? Because what better way to see if I'm good enough to become a hero? You you really want to fight other heroes to see if you're good enough to be one? Well, of course. What better way to find out if I'm good enough? If I can be some of the greatest heroes around, I could definitely, you know, be a good one. Um. Okay, okay, I, I, I kind of get your logic, but still, that's a tall order. I don't, I'm not sure if I can just get Endeavor and the others here, but... Hmm. How about this? Why don't we uh, go traveling together? Excuse me? Yes. We can find you other op opponents, you know, to do battle with. Not heroes, but people who would prove to be a challenge. Hmm. very well mother what may I go I I'm not I'm not sure if I if anything I need to keep an even closer eye on you mm, you're right thank you 
Can she come with us? What? Yes. I think she can keep me... Hmm. From destroying too much. Or keep me out of trouble. By the great mother she is. Uh, are you certain? Very. Uh, Miss Midoriya? On one hand, I don't want to see him fighting anyone, but on the other hand, it is the best option when it comes to keeping him safe. Um, okay. Thank you, Mom. Uh, I... I hope I don't regret this. I... I will try my best to make it so you don't worry about me. As years go by, Izuku, he's... He's been training. The only thing is... Always running out of people to fight with him. Because the speed, yeah, Gran Torino with his uh, smaller build as well as tactics can trip him up. It's just they can't knock him down. When he actually does face Endeavor, Ezekiel's skin isn't really being bothered by the amount of heat. Endeavor even brings on Shoto, who tries to freeze him. Which all it does is pretty much get him a little cold. He's like, yeah, this is, uh, this is very uncomfortable, but ultimately I can take this. So yeah, Endeavor, his pride is hurt. Shoto, his pride is hurt. Everyone who's ever tried to fight Izuku ends up with hurt feelings. They don't know what this kid's quirk can really do. Oh my, he's thinking, does he even need one for all? Is, is it even necessary for him? Because one for one in prison, and all his little crime syndicates or whatnot is just, there's no buzz from any of them. So yeah. It's easy to say that, wow, this kid is pretty strong. Which, when it comes to the UA interest exam, as soon as Izuku says, like, well, you want, wait, we want me to do what? I want to give, I want to give you a recommendation. I want you to take that. No. What? I am not taking no recommendation. Why? That'll make it so much easier. The things worth having aren't easy to obtain. What? Think of it like this. When your parent or someone you care about buys you something, you feel happy, you're good, you love the gift, yes. Well, yeah. But when you have to work for it, it makes you a whole lot more appreciative, doesn't it? Not uh, yes. Just like how you work your way up to the number one spot, I'm doing the same. I may have accepted your trading, but I am not receiving a handout from you. Uh, you're serious. Very. I can't believe this. You're you're really turning down my offer. Yes. And what of uh, Endeavor's offer? Oh, of his uh, daughter, Fuyomi. For Furumi. You, you can't even be bothered to remember her name. I have not met her. I cannot fall in love with someone who I have never met before. But I am very grateful for such a 
offer, I suppose. Uh, all right, so, um, what about your little trinket? Hmm? Oh, yes, that. I still don't know how it works. Not yet, at least.